get away from here. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, and the lead adventurer from the, uh, the other party is walking up to you and he says, what, what are you doing here, you amateurs? Get out of here. This is no place. This is no place for you. Uh, Cliffhanger. Okay. Because you've got a break. Right. right. Okay. So there's going to be like a 10 minute break. Replay audience and, and we never know if there's viewers. Yeah. Um, replay audience and viewers in a 10 minute break. Yeah. And then we will pick it up from there. I wonder if anybody knows what's going on. <laughs> I bet some of you out there do. Um, there, there's probably some people who would know what's going on right now. Really? Yeah. I wonder what's going on. Well, we'll see. Okay, so you are. You want to uh, tell me a quick recap? Where are you currently? We are on the way to the. Um, right. You were you were on the road on the way yeah. to Tommy Tonics. Uh, tonic, right. And original plan was stop the way in. But uh, on the way, we got this bunch of people. This. Yeah, a bunch of yeah. people blocking the road. Blocking well, that people, goblins, right? Right, goblins. A hundred or so goblins. Right. Lots and lots of goblins. Yeah. And also a team of adventurers, very impressive adventurers. Right. Um, who uh, you've never met before. Yeah. And, uh, um, so. and, a bunch of, and a bunch of goblins blocking the road, right? Yeah. And they were all yelling, they're all yelling... Um, all, all chanting and stuff, right? They're chanting, yeah. Night of the Crack, Night of the Crack, this is the night when the crack comes back. Night of the Crack, Night of the Crack, this is the night when the crack comes back. Huzzah! And they scream and they, um, they uh, yell and, and drink. One, one goblin like runs by in a drunken stupor and he hands you a, hands you a goblet with a beer and like spills some of the beer on you. He's all, Night of the Crack, Night of the Crack! And it's like really weird. It's like a rave, but for goblins, yeah. right? And uh, crack come back. Yeah, night, night of the crack, and the, and and they're all night of the crack, night of the crack. Um, so you you come off to this, uh, um, you step off to the side of the road right. uh, a little bit, and you meet uh, this other team of adventurers. Yeah. Uh, you and your party, Van Hammer and Zeeling. You uh, step off to the side of the road to meet this other party of adventurers. They're on this uh, sort of rock, rocky part of the road that looks like it's uh, like it's snow, but it's not snow. I mm. promise you. I know it looks like snow, but it's not. Okay. Um, <clears throat> okay. So, uh, and, and I'll just have this guy be one of the. This guy's the lead guy. Okay. He's a fighter. This really impressive fighter. In, uh, in gorgeous like armor you've never seen art right and it's like spikes all over you look super tough it must be like six foot mm -hmm. five or something like double your size you're a dwarf right mm -hmm. he walks up to you and he's waving his arms around he says you fools amateurs what are you doing here get out of here you'll be killed uh okay uh can you tell me what's going on here this is the night of the crack can't you see that there's a there's there's, there's, there's these these goblins is obviously this is you fools and he turns around he seems exasperated and turns to his compatriots, a couple of uh, uh, people from his party come up, one of them being uh, a really uh, gorgeous and powerful looking wizard. She's got flowing robes and a really antique uh, uh, looking staff. It, it glows with power, you can tell she's just like super powerful, right? <clears throat> and, uh, and she says, it's, it, it's too late, Grimwald. It's, it, it, it's too late to, to deal with any of these surprises. We, mu we must prepare immediately. Uh, at that moment, you feel the ground begin shaking. And it's like an earthquake. You're like, ah! And um, the, the adventurers look at each other and they scramble off to their, to their uh, temporary camp. They're gathering weapons yeah. and stuff like that. Yeah. The goblins uh, start cheering. They're all, it's coming! It's coming! It's the crack! Here comes the crack! Night of the crack! Night of the crack! This is the night that the crack comes back! And oh. you, you look at your party and you realize you maybe should should prepare if you want to get your weapons ready or something like you're not you look around you don't see anything causing this earthquake what's happening mm -hmm. right yeah 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 uh, so what's happening can someone tell me what's happening here? i don't know my lead van hammer says i don't know my lead this is i've never seen anything like this this is this is outrageous the adventurers are running around gathering equipment and stuff they seem to be in a great okay in a great haste um okay. Zeeling says i'm i'm afraid i suddenly fell out of my depth 
um, um, we uh, we're gonna just gonna have to play this by ear. Uh, uh, oh, okay. <laughs> at that at that moment, yeah. You notice uh, there's a huge uh, shake in the ground, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and a crack begins to open up in the ground, um, right between you and uh, and uh, these this team of adventurers. Okay. Right. Yeah. There's like a crashing sound, yeah. and uh, <clears throat> and a split in the ground opens up right there. Yeah. Um, a couple of goblins actually fall right into the crack. Huh. Right. Yeah. And uh, you hear them screaming down there. Although some of them are still, they're still going. Not in the crack. Ah! <laughs> and some of them fall down, fall down there. Yeah. There's also still. I'll remind you. Uh, first of all. Let's say your wagon's back over here on the road. Yeah. Right? And I'll remind you, your elephant is in the wagon. Okay. Um, there is also, as you recall, there was uh, this uh, this guy. There's an old goblin. All these yeah. other goblins are young, right? Mm -hmm. And there was this old goblin, remember? Mm -hmm. Yeah. He was running around. Yeah. He had like white hair. There was a white-haired old goblin. He's mm -hmm. running around. And before you saw him, he was running around with a staff. And he, he was trying to like get people to leave and, and get away from the, the scene. He... He's, he's still running around now that the, the crack has appeared, and he goes, Ah, it's too late, you fools! The crack has come! Uh, get out of here! Everybody, get out of here! Why why are you just running around? He runs up to you, and he says, Strangers, what, what are you doing here? Don't you know about the crack? No, what's going on with the crack? Can you tell me? He says, Every, every hundred years, the crack, the crack appears, and these foolish youngsters they don't understand the crack means death and they have some weird ideas about legends about people coming to stop the crack or something like that I don't know and it, they're, they're too young to remember they don't you fools and he freaks out and he starts running away mm -hmm. right but just then the crack gets even bigger <sighs> and he falls into it ah okay. you fools I tried to warn you okay okay everyone go back to the uh, wagon Right now. Oh, you. So you guys turn and you try to you try to run. run yeah, right. Run, you're trying run, to run back to the yeah. Uh, back to the wagon. Right. Right. At um, as you guys are training, you get like halfway, yeah. and then the ground shudders again. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah. And um, and the crack gets even bigger. Huh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. The crack gets bigger. Right. Mm -hmm. And um, and Zeling actually loses her footing. And mm -hmm. like has fallen part way into the into the crack. Yeah. Right. Has okay. fallen part way in. That, okay. that goblin guy's already already in there. Mm -hmm. um, on the other side, um, you see the uh, the other party, a fighter and a mage and mm -hmm. a rogue. Mm -hmm. uh, the rogue is very cleverly hiding behind a rock because that's what rogues do. Sorry, mm -hmm. that's just a little side thing there. Okay. Um, <clears throat> And uh, and the fighter is, is preparing. He's gathered. He's like run up to the edge of the crack, like mm -hmm. he's going to do something. The wizard is preparing. She's standing up on a rock and she's mm -hmm. preparing her spell. Mm -hmm. um, she's, you can tell that she's preparing some sort of some sort of powerful spell. Mm -hmm. um, now you guys have fallen down, so it's going to take you a, a bit to regain your footing. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now everybody gets to roll initiative. <laughs> okay. Fourteen. Ah, the world got higher initiative than you. Hmm. Okay, give me a second there. Yeah. Huh. The wizard's waving her hands around, and you hear her uh, incanting uh, arcane language in the ancient tongue. Oh. And, yeah, she's going... I just made that up. Yeah. And she casts a, a magic, uh, a ball of blue magic that you don't recognize flies out of her hands and into the into the pit. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Into the crack. The crack is continually growing, growing larger, and uh, and even though like at this point like a whole bunch of bug goblins, probably a, a dozen goblins have fallen into the crack, but some of them are still inebriated, right. and they're all shed. There's a few are still shouting night of the crack, but a bunch of them have run away, mm -hmm. right? And they're like, yeah! and some of them have just fallen over, and some of them have fallen into the crack. Yeah. This woman, um, the wizard, casts a, a ball of blue energy into the crack, 
and maybe it's designed to seal it or something like that. You can't tell. Mm -hmm. um, there's a shutter from the crack, and it and it grows even larger, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> the uh, wizard, uh, I'm sorry, the fighter, uh, a part of his foot starts to fall into the crack, but he he regains his his balance. Mm -hmm. At that moment, a giant tentacle reaches out of the crack. Whoa! Yes, a giant tentacle, a big big huge arm you can't exactly see what's on the other side of it but a huge arm reaches out of the crack huh. um it grabs the fighter okay <laughs> awesome it grabs the fighter and throws him into the forest whoa yeah whoa. and he goes flying off into the forest you literally never you didn't know that a person could fly yeah. that high you see him fly, it literally makes the sound of a missile and you hear an awful crash in the forest. Mm -hmm. um, the wizard looks just like almost frozen solid and yeah. uh, two green glowing eyes pop up out of, the, out of the pit and you see the head of a giant octopus huh. um, <clears throat> with glowing green eyes. Uh, it grabs the uh, wizard. Yeah, okay. Yeah, <laughs> awesome. It grabs the wizard um, and throws it uh, at uh, Van Hammer. Um, let's see what Van Hammer gets. So, uh, well, um, oh damn it! But she missed, and she throws the and uh, the wizard goes flying ah, past Van Hammer mm -hmm. and smashes into the wagon, oh. just a bloody mess, and falls against the falls against the wagon. Okay. Now it's your turn. Uh, first of all, I want to save Eileen, so I give, um, I pull a rope. You got a rope? I, I have a rope. You have pull, a rope? Yeah. Oh, you're going to throw the rope? Yeah, and she, okay, she you, grab it. She you grab yelled at her? Yeah. It's Zi Ling! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, so grab, this, grab the rope. Oh, okay, so you throw the rope. Yes. Go ahead, you throw the rope. Yeah, I and, did. And uh, she'll, she'll grab it. She'll grab it, and me, and... I'm going to say she's pretty good. Yeah, she's pretty good. She's a monk. So right. I'm not going to bother rolling. She grabs it. Yeah. And so, um, what, what is that? Um, Ben, can you, both of us pull her up? Uh, Van Hammer gets back up. He had to duck, you know, to yeah. avoid the flying wizard. Yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah. Uh, and he grabs the other, uh, he grabs on behind you. Yeah. Behind the uh, rope. Right. Okay, you, and you two start, start pulling. Right, right? we stop pulling. I'm here, I'm pulling, I'm okay. finally... Okay, uh, pulling her out. Okay, I'm going to say okay. it's going to yeah. take one turn for you to okay. for you to pull her out, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, as you're pulling up, <laughs> the crack gets a little big, okay. bigger. I didn't say she pulled out yet. Oh, okay. I'll say when she pulls out. <laughs> If she pulls out. Okay, okay, fine. <laughs> I'm the DM here. All right. Um, okay, the uh, wizard is... Uh, I'm sorry, wizard. Okay. The uh, uh, Oct giant octopus, octopus. has noticed yeah. uh, has noticed you pulling the uh, pulling her out. And right. it's going to grab her leg, okay? Yeah. yeah. Damn it. It got a one. I swear to God, you guys. You rolled a cl critical failure. Oh, man. Yeah. Uh -oh. Um... He grabs at um, he grabs at Zling. Yeah. The giant octopus grabs at Zling, mm -hmm. but actually um, accidentally pulls off a um, like a, a piece of her buckle right. and and stuffs it in its mouth, mm -hmm. uh, taking two damage. <laughs> okay. Uh, for eating for eating a piece of her her buckle. Okay. Incidentally, in case you guys didn't think I was doing that, that's for real. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. He takes two damage for eating a piece of her, her buckle, mm -hmm. and he goes. <laughs> okay, but you do manage to pull Zingling out. Okay. And she's standing next to the thing. I'll remind you, by the way, that she is at half strength. Okay. Uh, as she was bitten by a vampire. Okay. So now, um, I have a ring, so I'm going to wear the ring. And I'm trying to... Oh, you're to... always wearing a ring. Right. You, have you have an, a ring of animal uh, uh, um, influence. Influence, right. right. So I'm going to be friendship with that animal here. Yes. Son of a bitch. Ha, ha, Hold on ha. a second. <laughs> this giant octopus and animal. Yes. Go Give for me it. this thing. Wait, no. What does it say on the bottom of that? Give me that card. <laughs> TMG 188. Yeah. I'm sorry. Hold on a second. <laughs> game. Game time. Pause. <laughs> game pause. Yeah. I have a 188. Yeah. Ring of animal influence. Son of a bitch. Is it giant octopus and animal? Yes. It sure seems like it would be. 
Of course. You talk, all right, you connect with the... Friendship! The, the octopus stops stops trying to grab a zingling's leg and it looks right. at you. And then like a sort of dramatic tunnel forms between the two of you. It's right. like there's just the two of you and there's that sort of like romantic uh, right. string music. Yeah. And you also cast animal friendship, right? Right, right. I, I, I speak with animals. Right. Right? So, you, yeah. you have to, okay, so you just have one charge left in that. Okay. In that room, one spell left in that room right. today. Yeah, okay? yeah. Right, and... Um, and it looks at you, um, I gotta see what it is. Shit! It's got a negative three charisma. <laughs> and that's the saving throw. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Alright. And, and it looks at you and it says, uh, 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 what, What's up, man? Hey, man. Hold on, let me, let me take a break from my, let me take a break for a second here. From my, uh, from my Exercise? every 100 years, 100 years attack. <laughs> okay. And, uh, I, 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 I just want to, I just want to take a second and, uh, and meet my new friend. What's, what's up, friend? Hey, we are just trying to pass to this area. Um, I know you have to wait. Oh, it's to... the night of the crack, though, girl. This only happens once every hundred years. Oh, that's good. I'm not going to interfere with you. I just want to pass this area. You can continue have your thing or whatever for, I don't know, every 300 years, 500 years. Oh, it's, there's going to be the, oh, I'm, there's more than this, though, girl. There's more than this behind me. This is just the beginning of the night of the crack. Oh, okay. You, don't, if, doesn't anybody remember the night of the crack? I mean, I, if you like, you can tell me more about I'm just trying to pass this area. I well, I got. I mean, I got to tell you, there's a clock because there's a bunch of guys behind me mm -hmm. waiting to come out of the crack. Oh, okay. And, yeah, uh, I mean, I mean, I'm nice, but there's a bunch of other. Oh, okay. Maybe anyway, not so, nice. so since you have so many arm, we really have to get out this place. Can you grab us one by one to pass this crack, and we can pass it? Oh, yeah, but, but we want yeah, to. well, this is good and. <laughs> 